Hello everyone and welcome to another Feed Army video. My name is Emmanuel and today we will talk about a new update to the product title within Google Merchant Center. So now that we have a look at the title policy, um, so this is the policy update and that is this section here. So basically what it says is that add the product's brand name if it's a differentiating factor. If you sell products from many different brands and the product's brand is a differentiating characteristic of the product, add the brand name of the product title so that users can understand who makes the product you are selling. And then you can learn more about the product brand attribute. Actually adding the brand name is regardless of what Google suggests is a good idea because most people want to buy specific brands. So there's no point hiding the brand um, by just adding the product name and then for example some other keywords um, but actually prepending the brand name and then adding the product name that is the most recommended uh, setup actually um, so that users can see consumers can see um, what you are selling and then it also says keep in mind that you can only use your own merchant brand name or company name in the short title attribute if you actually manufacture the product you're selling. For products you don't manufacture yourself, you are required to use the original manufacturer's brand name in the product title. So for example, my company is feedarmy.com. I would not want to add then feedarmy.com and then uh, let's say Nike shoes, but then remove the word Nike and then just add the shoe product name in there without the manufacturer's name so you shouldn't be doing that um, at the moment it seems like it's more of a recommendation and not a policy violation however i wouldn't see logically why you would not want to do that because you want to be able to sell um, the product based on the brand because that has the uh, highest uh, amount of impressions and then ctr and then ultimately a conversion so that is a new update that just got uh, updated uh, today. So make sure that you prepend the brand to the title as that is now hinting at a requirement uh, if the uh, products that you sell are different based on the product brand name. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out or leave a comment downstairs. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in next one.